All right, YouTube peeps, welcome. We are on page 20. Starting at the top, we're doing an M here. Let's touch the bottom, top, bottom, top, bottom, middle. Now, if you look at the instruction in the book, they don't touch the top all three times. But that's, uh, that's the way I like to do it there. Okay. Top, bottom, top, bottom, top, bottom, middle. The reason I like to do it this way is it just gives better guides. I, always, I like to tell my kids stuff. Anytime you change a direction, it should be on a line. So notice anytime I change a direction, it's right on one of the top, middle, or bottom lines. So top, bottom, top, bottom, top, bottom, middle. Remember, you can always pause the video if you need to watch me do more, a little faster now. Okay, moving on to the lowercase m, same exact thing. We're just kind of keeping it contained within that bottom level. Bottom, middle, bottom, middle, bottom, middle, bottom, middle. Ooh, kind of messed up on these last two. Look at that. I didn't start at the bottom. You notice these last two lowercase ones? I started it just like the capital M up at the top. Oops. Bottom. Got to start at the bottom. A little faster now. Do one more, start at the bottom. Okay, moving on, we got the capital N. Start at the top. Once again, I like to go all the way and hit that top line. Same thing here with the N that I did with the M as I made, I went all the way to the top. You notice the example comes short, just like the capital M comes short. I like to go all the way, hit that top line. Do one more, top, bottom, top, bottom, end at the middle. Everything's nice and clean. Lowercase n, starting at the bottom.
couple more here. Bottom, middle, bottom, middle, bottom, middle. Last one. All right, that is page 20. Hopefully that helps you with your handwriting skills.